<laughs> okay guys, been shopping. This is from the Konken Farmers Festival. Last year I was there, I bought uh, a rice mill and a wood chipper. This year I bought another wood chipper. The other one was a piece of junk. It actually blew itself up. Lucky it didn't blow me up. And a chainsaw. Now chainsaws in Thailand is very rare. Very unusual. It's only the last couple of years that they've been around. And as you can see, they're not exactly brand name. But uh, they're getting more popular. There's all kinds of rules. There used to be all kinds of rules anyway about chainsaws. And the average person couldn't have one. You needed a license. And if you got caught with a chainsaw, you went to jail. Simply because everybody was cutting down all the old trees. And Thailand got no more trees. This is the, the wood chipper. This thing is uh, just put together. It's got like one minute on the engine. <laughs> so let's do the chainsaw first. She's uh, quite the machine, this thing. <laughs> kind of a joke, really. The one that they had there, the guy's using it, show me it, works fine. Something very strange though, and I think it must be Thailand rules. I assume it's Thailand rules. The bar is only 11 and a half inches, which is very, very short. See, 11 and a half inches. That's, that's really, that's pretty tight. Again, this thing is uh, brand new, they started it. It's the same, uh, same brand name as the, as the wood chipper, but a different color. Let's see if she'll start. Out of gas, maybe. <laughs> yeah, out of gas. That's how much gas you get. <laughs> but she starts anyway. She sounds right. I wouldn't think she'd be very good for anything heavy duty. And that little bar that looks funny, yeah. He told me it's uh, 49 cc, which I didn't believe. But I don't see anywhere on the box. It says. Uh, 0.6 of a horsepower, I don't know. It's a uh, pretty lightweight. Very lightweight. It's not something I really need, but I got one. Costs uh, 4,500 baht from the ones that I've seen for sale on Facebook lately, and there's been a lot. Like I say, this is a new thing for Thailand. They've been around a couple of years, but they're getting popular now. That's the going rate. That's cheap. Something to play with. I need to go buy oil and gas. Now this thing, can you see that? Emergency shut off, which is nice. Choke on. That's the throttle, it's a heavy duty. There's about a couple of gas in here.
That started easy, didn't it? Didn't it? Chips, not bad. Not too bad. This thing does up to six centimeters, just over two inches. Uh, that's bigger than I need, so so far so good. Need to deflect that. That's all right. There we go. Be all right. This thing costs uh, fourteen thousand eight hundred, which is uh, actually marked down from twenty thousand to twenty-two thousand. And the ones that I saw last year, different brand, were all twenty-two, twenty-three thousand. So fourteen eight. That's a good price as long as she keeps running. I will have lots of wood chips. <laughs> There's one mountain. Gotta get stuff out of the way. Alright guys, well there it is. Another trip to the Farmer's Festival. Another truckload of stuff. As always guys. Thanks for watching. Some other stuff we got. Banana. Make the big bananas big for here. A couple of mulberry plants. Lots of mulberry trees around here, but they use them as a different kind of mulberry. They use the leaves for uh, silkworms. Oh, we got a grasshopper. Uh -huh. This wood. You eat my garden. My fish eat you. But these are mulberries, and there's, you know, there's flowers. You see a little flower right there. There's a fruit somewhere. Right there. So hopefully we can get at least one of these going. Something different. Tap on the tank and the fish come. Gone. Speaking of different, this is so different it doesn't even have a Thai name. Cape Gooseberry. And in Thai they call them Cape Gooseberry. <laughs> so they're new to Thailand, they don't even have a Thai word for the name. I've never seen them in here before, I've never eaten them before actually. Delicious. Hopefully, uh, I'll remember to save a couple, get some seeds, full of seeds. Tiny little seeds, I don't know if you can see them. Very good. Alright, guys. That's it this time, for real.